What? What are you doing? I have a secret to tell you guys. And you'll find out in a second. Should we go try and put stuff in my car? Yeah. Yeah. You gonna say anything? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wanted to start off this video by saying this video is a little bit of a mess. It's a little bit disorganized because it was like my first moving vlog. So I wasn't even sure exactly what I was going to like put in here because I didn't know what I was going to do and have, if that makes any sense. But in the future, I will be like, the videos will be a lot more organized. This is just the start. So it's a little bit rough, but it's going to get better. Welcome to my apartment. So I actually, obviously I already have the apartment, I already have the keys, but I don't live here right now because I have ordered a bunch of furniture, but I don't know if it's even because of Corona or just because, but so much of the stuff that I ordered was on back order. So I'm waiting till I actually have more furniture here to actually like move in and live here because there's no point in living here when I don't have furniture. With that, I also wanted to say, I'm not, that sounds like I'm saying like, oh yeah, a couple months until I move in. That's not it at all because that would be stupid. Um, it's just like a couple days or a couple weeks. I really am just waiting on a couple things. I'm obviously not like expecting it to be 100% completed and fully furnished when I moved in, when I move in. Um, I'm just waiting for like a couple big pieces that like you need like a dining table and a couch. I'm also close to home still, so I'm still gonna be going home a lot. I wanted to come here today because I have some furniture that I want to put here and I also want to like scrub everything. They did clean it before I moved in here, but I just, I never, I don't trust what other people clean ever. I always have to clean it myself because. You're free. Sorry about the audio, I do need, it's obviously very echoey in here because I don't have any furniture and I am going to get a new mic for my camera, but this is going to be the first of several like moving vlogs, apartment vlogs. I don't really know yet, but moving vlogs are some of my favorite videos. I think they're so interesting and so entertaining and I have such like a vision of how I want my apartment to look. So I can't wait for you guys to like see how it comes along and I'm really excited to see how it comes along too because I have ordered some cute ass stuff. I am really excited. Okay, we have one more thing in the car that we are going to go get. That's a heavy ass table. I'm just gonna give you guys like a really small empty apartment tour. Come in. This little area needs to be cleaned. Washer and dryer mix. Come through here. Here's my kitchen. Dishwasher, shelves, sink, fridge, stove. Really cute tiles, has lots of character. My bathroom, sink, toilet, tub. Closet. Fun fact, toilet paper literally doesn't fit in there. It's like too, it's not white enough. I have bought some things from my apartment, literally just like toilet paper, some cleaning supplies, tampons. But these tiles I think are so cool. It just has such, I don't know, it's just a nice vibe in here and I think it will look a lot nicer obviously once it's all decorated, but. For some reason my apartment has a lot of hooks like this. And then this is my room. This is gonna be like a closet, kind of. It's a second bedroom, but it has these, so I'm just gonna use it as a closet. This closet is also awesome. A wall is taking up literally half of it. Some more hooks. This has nothing. It literally just is half of the closet. Out here, living room area. I don't know, like dining-ish area. I love this apartment because I feel like it has so much character. Like it just looks so like vintage and unique. Like the red brick is so beautiful. I am just so excited to like have it all decorated. I've been waiting for all my stuff to come for so long and it just still isn't here, so. Okay, I'm gonna get to cleaning because I have a lot to clean. I'm about to go pee for the first time in my apartment. Oh.
like my neighbors have like Black Lives Matter signs in their windows, which just makes me happy. And there's like a bunch of pride flags and trans flags. I just love it, you know? Good community over here. This coming right now? Say hi. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hey! <laughs> 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 Check. We're at Ikea and made the mistake of not getting a cart before we came up here, so... Hi, um... Excuse the way I look, I just, I literally look crazy, but I just barely woke up, but I just wanted to like talk about something that has to do with my apartment. So, um, I basically ordered some furniture from this guy who custom makes them in like Sweden, like somewhere in Europe. And I first emailed him in August because I figured this would be like, it could be like a long process because you know, that's a lot to make custom furniture. I ordered a desk and a dining table. And two weeks ago, he said that they were just finishing up like the final touches and that they would be ready to ship the beginning of like this week. It's Friday, so they should have shipped like a couple days ago. So I didn't hear anything from him, so I emailed him and said, hey, what's up? Has my stuff shipped? And he just told me that for, did I already say what I ordered? I ordered a desk and a dining table. So he said that my dining table is done, which is the thing that I was like, the most excited for. He said that that was done. And then he said my desk, they like, have like some tool to make it that broke and they're ordering that tool and it will take like two weeks to ship so it will just be a while till like, I get my desk and I'm just kind of frustrated because he like didn't tell me which I understand shit happens I'm just kind of upset that he like was just barely telling me like after I had to like reach out to him and be like hey did my stuff ship and I was expecting it all to like be ready I don't know I am just the most impatient person in the whole entire world and I have just been waiting for so much stuff to get shipped like for example I bought some stuff from anthropology and it was supposed to ship on November 4th and it got back ordered to November 27th and I know shit happens I just am so impatient and it literally just drives me nuts and I don't really know what else to say about it. I am realizing these last couple days that it's going to take like a lot of time to get everything perfect before I can do like a little apartment tour and before like I'm going to be like 100% done decorating, which was expected, but I don't know. I'm impatient, like I said. I just like, I'm really excited to move in and I'm obviously like still at my mom's and I haven't even started packing anything because I've been waiting for my furniture to come because there's no reason for me to move into the apartment with literally no furniture pretty much when I can like be at my mom's house where, you know, I have furniture. I have been going through it with anthropology and my couch, which was also supposed to ship on November 4th and it's currently the 13th. And I think it's finally shipped. I have um, two of my friends coming and I don't even have that much stuff. They just like want to come and hang out. I started building my TV stand with Jens, but we needed a drill and I didn't know that. So we're probably going to take a drill. Me and my mom are going to finish that, which is going to be exciting. I have a rug that I can put down. I should probably vacuum first. Maybe I'll take my little vacuum from my house and like do that. But I do have some things that are like coming along, which I'm excited about. First meal in the apartment. Cheese. <laughs> Little update, um, we brought everything in from my mom's car. We mostly got kitchen stuff from Ikea. I have like all of this over here. I have the, all of this kitchen stuff down here. Oh, they're cute, huh? 
table on. Don't yeah. put it, don't with your shoes. Yeah, let's put my shoes on. Um, yeah, so we'll put the... Like I have like dish soap that's like in the bottle. But Why like, didn't you hand wash all those dishes then? Oh, I guess I forgot that I even had it. I mean, it's not a big deal. Like I'm not stressed about doing that right now. <laughs> okay, stop. I just am overwhelmed. Okay, I just stop do much stuff. And then I had a freaking brush. <laughs> stop. <laughs> stop. First things going in my fridge. Tanger. Tangerine LaCroix. Yes! Second thing going in my fridge. Hello Kitty pasta sauce. Oh. Yes! Actually, let's put you right... Oh, do you have soy sauce in there too? I didn't even know! <laughs> What's in the Hello Kitty guy? Girl. Crack. String positions. You know what? I'm so annoying. <laughs> oh, you're such a my position. Oh, you look so pretty right there. <laughs> Avery's gonna get mad at me, but I'm gonna sing. Be that. You should. Those are like the best, especially for like the last day or like the day after. <laughs> yeah. <be> smart. Oh. <laughs> oh fuck! This is so bad. <laughs> what a note to end it on that was all for this first moving vlog i hope you guys enjoyed the next ones um i just know we're gonna be better so yeah new exciting chapter in my life i'm moving out i am an adult crazy shit um i appreciate you guys and i love you guys and i miss you guys and thanks for watching Mwah.